Hey guys, my name is James Diaz. Today I'm going to teach you how to play Broken Things by Matthew West on the guitar. So let's get started. The chords for the intro is going to be the C to a D minor to an F to an A minor to a G to an F. And then you go into the verses. The chords for the verses is going to be a C to an F to a C to an A minor to a G, to an F, to a G, and then to a C. And you just repeat that. So C, F, C, A minor, G, F, G, C. And the chorus for the chorus. Now I'm just a beggar in the presence of a king. It's going to be a C, to a D minor, to an F, to an A minor, to a C, to an F. Now you're going to repeat that, but you're going to play a C at the end instead. C, D minor, F, A minor, F, C. And those are the chords for the chorus. So that's basically all the chords that you need to know for this song. So what I'll do is I'll play the intro, the first verse, and the chorus, so you can see where these chords are placed in the song, and then I'll teach you a simple strumming pattern you can use at the end of the video. All right, so then the intro is going to go. Oh, oh, First, first. If grace was a kingdom, I stopped at the gate, thinking I don't deserve to pass through after all the mistakes that I have made. But I heard a whisper as heaven bent down. Said, child, don't you know that the first will be last and the last get a crown? Then you go into the chorus, and the chorus goes, Now I'm just a beggar in the presence of a king. I wish I could bring so much more, but if it's true, you use broken things. And here I am, Lord, I'm all yours oh, 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 oh. And then you go back into the second verse, but it's the same as the first verse. That's basically where all, all the chords are placed in the song, so I'll teach you a basic strumming pattern you could use now. A really basic strumming pattern you could use now is going to be down, up, up, down, up, up, down. Up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down. So, down, up, up, down, up, up, down. And just repeat that. All right, it's going to be down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up. So, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down. Right, that's a really basic strumming pattern you could use for this song. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that that helped you. I want to let you guys know about an awesome book called The Girl with the Train by Anthony Eden. These videos are sponsored by this book. It's really, really awesome. I read the whole thing myself. It's on Amazon. It's a really, really good book. It's a post-apocalyptic magnet punk. Like, it's like steampunk, but with magnets. And it's really, really awesome. You guys should check it out. Link in the description below. And uh, if you guys do get it and you like it, I want to ask if you guys could leave a review saying that James Hughes Music sent you, because that would be awesome. And I'll see you guys in another one.